Uh, let's talk a little bit. Last week when Jen was with us, uh, we talked about the idea of some fundraisers taking place uh, here at McElhaney out on the lot in the corner. And uh, we had the honored flight uh, just a few weeks ago. And I understand we have something coming up this weekend. We do. We do. Um, we do have another barbecue this weekend. It is for uh, the Boy Scouts of America, the local Boy Scout uh, troop here. They're going to come out. We're going to do something similar to what we did with the Honor Flight. We're going to host a barbecue, um, try to get a lot of people out to support, you know, that great organization there. Um, and another nice thing that we're going to do kind of in concert with that is we're going to have the, um, uh, the Boy Scouts actually uh, join up with our service department um, in looking to get a, an auto repair uh, merit badge. So we're, we're actually going to kind of, it's sort of a, a two-phase deal. One yeah. is to, to raise some money for a great cause for, for some youngsters there, but also to uh, help them further their education through the Scouts. Now you're not going to give them wrenches and let them start tearing apart. Well, cars, maybe right? your car, Chris. I think that's a good uh, a good starter, but I don't think we're going to let them loosen any customer cars quite yet. I mean, it'd be about the same as having, you know, Matt Weiss there worked on somebody's <laughs> car, but no. Whoa, oh, there's a shot across I the know, just I don't know if he listens, but I had to take one shot at him. No, that's great that uh, you're getting with the Boy Scouts and, and the different badges. I I tried Boy Scouts, mm -hmm. and they were way too structured and, yeah. you know, wanted me to follow rules. But uh, I can appreciate what they go through. And I know I have some friends who uh, have children in the Boy Scouts. First off, thank you for giving them the opportunity. No but problem. to earn the badges like that, at a place like McLean. that that's huge. That, not only for you guys from a community standpoint, but from the kids to get to see a professional, you know, well-organized uh, ballet of, of auto repair going on. Yeah, it's, it's pretty amazing. I know we've touched on it before, but our, uh, our service mechanics, just like our body technicians, it's unbelievable the skill set that these guys have. They, they really, you know, could basically be engineers in their own right because the technology um, has changed so much in terms of using computers to do diagnostic work, um, anything from an alignment to using our, uh, our laser measuring system back here uh, in the collision center to get everything right back in the specs of, of where the car uh, you know, should be, basically, as it came from the manufacturer. Um, I'm continually impressed with, uh, with the guys there. It's, it's more and more difficult anymore to see a, a backyard mechanic or an independent really being up on the technology to fix a car that was, was manufactured in the last several years. Yeah, 1976 Chevy Impala compared to the uh, 2011 Chevys, those two totally different there is a little There's a little difference. I'm, I'm driving my 1977 uh, MGB, so that, you know, that's not something I can tinker with so much, but uh, there, you know, there's some folks that really could dig deep into that, uh, but, you know, again, the technology's changed quite quite a little bit in the last 35 years. Yeah, so. quite a bit, quite a bit. So uh, the, the cookout with the Boy Scouts, is that 11 to 2 on Saturday? Does that sound I, right? I believe that's correct, yeah. Okay, so come out and... Uh, and uh, support the Boy Scouts, the local troops here, as they uh, cook and, and welcome you to the McElhaney uh, lot. And who knows, you might drive away with a new car uh, when you're here as well. So come and support the Boy Scouts 11 to 2 this Saturday at uh, McElhaney's. Now, we also talked with Jen about uh, all of this social media and all this stuff. Sure. Giving away a 55-inch television. Have you been playing bouncing balls? To I, try and I, I haven't. Uh, maybe I've been playing under a pseudonym because I can't, you know, as an employee, I can't win. So... Uh, if there's a Jay Smith involved yeah. there, um, you know, it might have my address under there and everything else because I could really use a, you know, a TV for the man cave. Well, 55-inch so. television is a pretty good-sized TV. Hey, you got football season about to start, and exactly. uh, whether you're a college or pro, well, I guess you, the pros have started here with the uh, the preseason. Yeah. So thank goodness NFL football's back. Back and alive and well, and uh, but I, you know, I'm more of a, a college football guy myself. So That's not I, I'm ready either. for that that to be here. We're, we're uh, less than two weeks away. From now, that. who's who do you watch? Hawkeyes, Cyclones. Uh, it, it's uh, Hawkeyes and uh, and my Fighting Irish. Uh, I'm, oh. I'm a Notre Dame alum, so I uh, I don't know how many listeners out there are, are uh, either you know None Subway now, alumni. Yeah, channel. everybody's switched. <laughs> no, but uh, but I love watching the Hawks uh, Hawks play and uh, you know see that that team too. So I try to catch. One or two uh, Iowa games, uh, you know, in person, and, and try to get out to South Bend a couple times too. Yeah. So, well, and if you win a 55-inch Vizio high-definition television, it's like taking the trip, only saving the gas. That's right. So, if you haven't gotten yourself uh, into the, what we're talking about here, go to Facebook, look up McElhaney, and join the like their page, and then play the little video games that they have on there. If you reach a certain point, I think it's 20,000 points, they invite you to a party. You have to come to the party, then they're going to give away a TV. No purchase necessary. Just like their French or uh, like their Facebook page on uh, Facebook there, and uh, who knows? You could take home a 50 inch, 55 inch television. That's yeah. pretty big. And that drawing's coming up soon, right? When is it? When is that going to be? September 10th. September 10th. Thank 
Jen yeah, Jen, Jen's whispering into the ear. Yeah, in, that's, in your that's, ear really, ear. that's a good thing. She's like our producer. She that's tells us right. what to say. So June or June tenth, September tenth, we will uh, we'll have the winner of that. We can talk about that on the show uh, the following Tuesday, and and hopefully we'll say Chris Streets put a brand new 55 inch Vizio in his. You'll have to deliver it though. I'm thinking it won't fit in my grand name. Yeah, I was gonna say that the fix might be in if you're uh, you're the winner here, Chris. You oh, come on. I, I love playing. <laughs> I, I'm gonna become a professional bouncing ball player. That's good. If That's there's good. Such I, a thing. Yeah, I wonder if there's a spot on your W two to you know report your income for for that. So. And, uh, our time is up here this morning with the McElhaney Minute, Drew. I appreciate it very much. Uh, Again, if people want to know about the Abra Express, they can give you a call. Absolutely. It, it really is a neat program, and as far as I'm aware, uh, there really isn't another shop within probably 40 miles that's that's doing anything similar to it. So it's a good way to save some time and, uh, and get your car fixed you know, as quickly as possible, but have it done the right way. All right, so there you go. The Abra, the McElhaney Abra Collision Center here at the McElhaney's just off of uh, Highway 30 as you come into Clinton. Everybody knows where McElhaney's is. It's, uh, but uh, the Abra Center is in the back to the right. Come and find them if you need uh, repair to your automobile. Uh, the collision stuff, they can take care of in no time. This new Aber Express, fantastic. Uh, drop off your car and then wait for the call to tell you that it's all finished. So come and find out more. Find out if your insurance company qualifies with the Aber Express and uh, get your automobile fixed when you need it here at McElhaney's Aber Collision Center. The McElhaney Minute with Drew McElhaney. Again, thanks, Drew. Thanks very much, Chris. And we will talk to you next week. Join us again next Tuesday morning at 9.30 for the McElhaney Minute here on AM 1390 KCLN and 1390KCLN.com. Don't forget, Boy Scouts cooking at McElhaney's this Saturday from 11 to 2.